First of all, I remind you that the Big Bang is a theory. About 14 billion years ago, a giant explosion called the Big Bang happened. The universe that we can observe today went boom. But what happened before the Big Bang? What was before it? This is Spaces. How our universe was created or born from nothing remains a mystery. But scientists still need to try to figure it out. According to theoretical physicist Sean Carroll, the Big Bang is a moment in time, not a point in space. Carroll assumes it is possible in this way that the universe was teeny tiny or infinitely large at the time of the Big Bang. It was very dense. There is no way to observe what happened in the time before the event in question. The universe is everything, and there is nothing outside it. Things were denser and hotter than it is now at the Big Bang. There was no more outside of it than there is today. This may seem a bit philosophical. As Carl Sagan says, the Big Bang is our modern scientific creation myth. It comes from the same human need to solve the cosmological riddle. Physicist Carroll depicts what he thinks actually, the universe did not expand into space. Instead, space itself expanded. Whether you are on Earth, Mars, or other places in the universe, when you trace yourself back 14 billion years, you come to what was extremely hot, dense, and rapidly expanding. The first second is a huge mystery. We do not know what happened in the universe until one second following the giant explosion that paved the way for today's order. What we know is that the universe cooled off enough for protons and neutrons to collide and stick together. Have you ever heard about inflation? This time it is not related to finance. A common view says the universe went through a process of exponential expansion during that first second. This is called inflation in astronomy. For Stephen Hawking, events cannot be measured, so they are undefined before the Big Bang. According to Hawking, time and space are finite, but they do not have any boundaries or starting or ending boundaries. Think of our planet. Earth is finite but has no edge. Events before the Big Bang have no observational consequences. Perhaps there was something else before the Big Bang that's worth pondering. One possibility is that the Big Bang is not the beginning of time. It was a moment of symmetry. Before the Big Bang, another universe was there, identical to this one but with entropy increasing toward the past instead of toward the future. Science can allow us to determine what happened right after the Big Bang. However, knowing what brought about it will likely be impossible. As it is frustrating, we also know that some things remain unknowable completely. That's actually a good thing in terms of being curious and investigative. <laughs>